guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we've got an epic show match between Queen Walkers and Darkest Muzan in the Tornado de Fuego, the fire tournament. Sorry if I'm pronouncing it wrong, but hopefully you guys enjoy. First attack is underway in Stadra. Looks like they're kicking it off super quick here. All right, Stadra coming in with the super witches. All right, good luck. Stadra of Queen Walkers. Here we go. Let's see. Starting with a balloon onto the mortar on the left side. All right. Blimpin' his way. Raging. Hold out a bit of the CC. The Lava Hound. Archers, balloons. And the Eagle Artillery is standing on the left side. Headhunters are coming over. Kills off the headhunter. No, wait, maybe. Baby dragon's going down fast. Oh, baby dragon's gonna work on the hound. He's got three super witches, four ice golems. Four ice golems in this attack from Sadro. Queen is down. Clearing these pups. Got one healer. Wait. It's only got one healer? It's only got one healer. It's got three loons. Yo, the healer finds the seeking air mine and it's gone. Okay. Sends the Yeti. Queen's gonna move her way into the e Eagle Artillery. He's gonna clear it. No. Drops an ice golem on. It's got like, like not that many troops left. <laughs> oh my goodness! But these the super witches are tanky. All right, queen taking out the air defense. Now working on the enemy queen. Got to burn her ability here. Sending an ice golem and a. Su oh, the queen's ability didn't go off. Oh no, dude! These super witches are all by themselves. The Queen ability was supposed to grab all that. King's ability goes off. Not going to get what he wants. Uses a free spell. I don't know what's going on here. He's still got the Royal Champion. He's sending them all in different sections. Drops an invisibility spell. The King does take out the scatter shot. But the Super Witches are not going to the Town Hall. Two of them do make their way into that compartment. What is going on here? Pops that Warren ability now. The Ground Expo is onto the Super Witch. And remember, the balance changes just went into effect. So that, that Town Hall Poison ramps up a lot faster. Plus, the, the Builder puts a lot larger radius now. And they're faster. There's a jump for a, the Super Witches. It's a Sui Super Witch. Never seen that before. But he's only got 10 seconds left. Um, rip. Rages up the RC. Might as well pop the RC ability now. Pop the RC! Oh. Dang. 71%. Dadra. Nice try. Alright, GUI. Taking on Kloss. Coming in with eight witches. Three golems. And setting that blimp to start off onto the town hall. Rages it up. We're going to take the town hall down. Town hall does go down here. All right. Now he's going to come in with seven super wizards. Hmm. See, that's the thing. I talked about it. How much of that will that poison affect the troops? Well, right there, the poison's not going to do anything. Because you use the blimp to take it down to the town hall. The biggest thing is going to be the headhunter DPS. The headhunter DPS has been decreased, making the headhunters not as strong anymore. Now he's going to send the witches, the super wizards, everything straight into the core of the space with that quad quake. Out comes that lava hound. Another headhunter does come out. Ice golem into the core is going to freeze this whole area up, which is pretty nice. King's moving his way into the eagle artillery section. And he's still hanging on to this royal champ. Rages up the core. Warden ability still intact here. He's not using it just yet. The Yak is still alive in there as well. So it pops the ability now. The Yak is going through. Royal Champion down at the bottom side at 6 o'clock. 
is looking pretty strong here with the three freezes and two invisibility spells to use. Tesla's did just pop here in Claus's base. Oh boy. I think we got ourselves. Potential. Wait. Oh, the queen died. Oh, wait a second. Where'd everything go? Where did it all go? All disappeared. Still got one freeze and invisibility. The RC can clutch things up here. All that mortar is hitting the witch. Oh no, his queen is still alive. What am I talking about? That's the defending queen in there. Ow. Never mind. I thought the queen died. He's got... He's got the... Ro the wooden queen. Who uses that skin? <laughs> Who uses that? Wait, he had an invisibility and let the RC die? Oh, rip. 38 seconds. Oh, man. He's gonna swag this invis. 26 seconds. There it is. Taking down Kloss. It's a three star. GG. GUI. Nice attack. With the super wizards. Gaku. Good luck, Gaku. 21 sneaky goblins. What? Four ice golems. Are you crazy? Five bats? Gaku's coming in with crazy. And Gaku only had 20 minutes to plan this. We saw Gaku coming with a 61 minion attack. When he took on Yo-Yo. This man is wild. And Gaku. What's your plan here? Oh my goodness. But he is walking. You know what he should have done? He should have put his warden on air mode. So, <laughs> imagine. It's like, yeah, I put my warden on air so that the healers don't transfer off to him. That would be 200 IQ as long as he doesn't hit any Ziki air mode. Alright, pulls out the CC of headhunters and more headhunters. Uh, these headhunters are not as strong anymore. So let's see. Look at that. Look at that difference right there. He just needed to do a poison. Normally, those headhunters probably could have absolutely smashed his queen. But all right. He's going to try to do it. Oh, a log launcher from 6 o'clock to open up this whole core. Okay. What? Jeez. King's going to run all the way around. This log launcher is doing work. Opening this whole middle compartment here for this queen. And he's going to freeze up the single target Inferno. Actually, yep, he finally does. Wow, okay. He sends an Ice Golem delay to go into the core, but that log launcher is crazy, opening up everything. Here comes... He pops that War Eternal Tome. The Sneaky Goblins go into the Town Hall now. And they take... No! They don't. He sends two more Sneakies for the Town Hall. He freezes it up. Ice Golems come out. And the Sneakies take the Town Hall down. The Golem is tanking the Wizard Tower. What? I didn't even see the Sneaky Goblins come in. Yo, Gaku. Yo, what? What? 22 sneaky goblins? Five bat spells? Four golems? And he had another- he had like seven ice golems. Ah! The heck? Gaku! You're insane. Manta on Utah. Oh. There we go. There we go. Okay. Oh. Jeez, look at his pets. This guy's got max pets. Without a hero potion. What? Dude, my pets are lucky to be level 5. Holy jace. Alright, you're gonna charge this queen. Bye bye, owl. Oh, that was nice knowing you, owl. Wizard trying to move the air defense. He freezes up the headhunters here. Helps clear them. And bam, the wizard grabs the AD. Oh, man. He's got the... Poison drops it. 
And when you're dealing with a hound, the perfect place to drop the poison is on top of your queen. So that all the pups get killed. And he didn't drop that poison properly because... He dropped... Well, eh, I guess the healers were angled a little bit, so... I guess that didn't... So normally, if you're attacking the hound straight on, you want to drop it on top straight on your queen. Cover all the pups. But, the queen's going to charge her way through the town hall compartment. Hybrid in between the king, going into the defending king, and the scatter shot. Freezes up the single target, rages up this healers. But there is... Wait! Oh! Healers... Dude, those healers are getting smacked by the town hall poison. Oh my god! <laughs> Look at that! The town hall poison is doing work to those healers. So that means that you should put some red air bombs next to your town hall nowadays. If you're going to charge those queen and the healers through it, you may, you may lose them, man. There's a red air bomb! One more, they're gone! The town hall poison doing work. I think the, you got to put some red air bombs next to that town hall now. The Royal Champion outpaced those hogs real quick. Has another rage spell. The RC takes down the cannon. Oh, those eagle... The eagle shot's gonna ruin these miners. Is this gonna be a defense? Leaving that eagle up, man. Oh, rip. Utah's base... ...is going to defend. GG. Town Hall poison effect. Absolutely shredded the healers because he charged the queen straight through it. GG to Utah's base. That queen ability will have to pop it here. That's the defense queen walkers needed. Pops the queen ability. Gonna be in the 80s here. 77. 78. 79. He's almost there. He's gonna get it. 80%. All right. Darkest Muzan. I think they'll still have the advantage because Stadra... Oh, sh sure. Stadra had a 71, so yeah. And that's an 81. So they're still up on 10%. Stars for Queen Walkers coming in. What did we got here? We've got six Super Wizards. we got three Witches that are going to be used with that King to walk around. We've got a Log Launcher. Hmm. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Hold on. Let's see. Darts this queen off to the right side. Oh, finds a seeking air mine right to the face of a healer. Yikes. At least he's got a unicorn on her. Now he's going to try to charge this queen into the enemy queen and the multi target inferno. Holy Jays, another seeking air mine! <laughs> Oh, this whole area is completely trapped for a queen charge. Rip a potential queen charge in here. Oh, no, no, no. The base, the defender knew it. And he trapped it. He lost two healers. Just like that. Yikes. Oh, another one! There's another thing here. There's going to be another one when he steps up. There's another thing here, boy! Holy jeez! He's out of healers! Oh no! <laughs> Holy jeez! Stars, what are you gonna do? You've lost all your healers! There's so many taking air mines! Oh no, no, no! The queen's dead! And another taking air mine! He lost all his healers! Oh no! There goes the witches on the outside! A log launch from across the town hall! Yo, he's going all out. He hasn't even dealt with the CC yet. Oh, no. He lost all of that. He's got the pop warn ability. Pop it, pop it. Your log launcher is not going to make... Oh, okay. Never mind. He's got king ability. Here comes the CC. There's a skeleton. There's king ability. He's still hanging out of the royal champ. He's got three freezes. He's got War Internal Tome, but he's not using yet for some reason. Hey, okay, maybe he's saving it for the Super Wiz in the corner, but they got stuck on the Hound. Freezes up the single in the expo. The Royal Champ rages her up to try to save this town hall. Hopefully, the RC. Oh, there's Lava Pups. RC's getting through this section. He's saving the Warn ability. 
Rage is the RC, which is clutch here. Not gonna lie. Oh, no. No more. Oh, he pops the RC ability. No more freeze. Can Gaku hold up a crazy defense? Good luck. The owl is getting hit. He's got a super wizard. Four. Two Pekkas. Alright, alright. Now Darkest Muzan knows a two star out. Well, maybe not. Queen Rockers definitely gets more triples. But it is heavily favored favoring targets because they not only have the star advantage now but they also have the percent advantage i mean he is attacking from the opposite side of the town hall which has a chance has a chance this core is stacked but these builders oh man oh my goodness wow now the warden not hitting the royal champion yet he will now. Wow. Dude, he's killing the R just outside of the RC, RC range. Look at that. Wow, that was an easy kill for the Warden. And he grabs the platform. And now the Queen and the Golem pull the Warden back. Sends a Headhunter in. Log launcher across from 6 o'clock here. Super Wizard's coming in. He's going to look to try to break through the core with the Log Launcher. Oh, he's taking the risk. Out comes a golem and a lava hound, which is going to slow him down. The balloon pull is sig sigging air mine. Okay. Drops the poison into the core. He still has the war internal tome. All the hero abilities. Freezes up the queen. The logs break inside the middle of the base. There's a rage. Pops that war internal tome. There's a jump to the backside. Out comes yetis. Oh my, look at this core. He smashes right through it. Jumps to the town hall compartment. Oh, wait. The king goes over to the top side. But he's still got the queen ability intact. He's got the royal champion coming out of the bottom side down there. There's the freeze out of the town hall. Yetis make their way there. Drops the rage for the town hall. The town hall is going to go down. Clears that with ease. With an invisibility spell for the baby dragon up top, maybe? No, the baby dragon can clear the archer tower. And this is a three. Crushed it. Wow. And now that puts it even way less hope for Queen Walkers here. Queen's ability going to be used. Darkest Muzan showing up. Coming in with a strong defensive showing. And there it is. Another triple for Darkest Muzan. Klaus is in. Take it out, Mancha. What do we got? Seven bats. Nine hogs. One Valk. Two golems. Two ice golems. Hmm. Hmm. You're not that Kartik. Oh, you're a different Kartik. What? You're a different Kartik? Which Kartik are you? I'm so confused. What? All right, the Royal Champ. Hmm, pops the ability, finds the Teslas. Is there a Lightning? No, he doesn't. Multi-target Inferno. Oh, the Tesla farm doing work. The Royal Champ, can she get through it here? Hold on. The Royal Champ does clear the Tesla. The Hog is going to pull a bit of the CC. Pulls two little archers. Okay. Where's this queen going to charge into? Hmm. Queen's going to go in? Yes, she does. She goes into the multi. Got eight hogs, two golems. Warden walk with this queen. Two balloons. King's going to try to grab the town hall here. Wizard onto the archer tower. Ooh, rages up the queen with this warden. Does have a jump spell for the middle. Out comes some headhunters. 
The warden is between the king and the queen here. He can pop the warden into a tome. He does to protect this queen through the lava hound. The healers are under rage. Poisons the headhunters just now. He's got to jump. He can jump right there, but he's not. He's got eight hogs, two golems still to use. What the? He's waiting. He's waiting here. Warden comes back. Drops a golem down south for some wizards. Boston is golems, man. He loves them. Drops the jump into the middle. Rages the queen up. He can't reach the scatter shot from that jump. Drops bad spells onto the scatter. The multi goes down. Pops the queen ability. But he already used the real champ earlier. What I'm talking about. Oh, the eagle locks out of the bats. Oh, bats. Oh, they get into the eagles. Death ring. The Oh, my goodness. The bats save themselves by getting close to the eagle. Holy. Drops ice going on the outside. He's keeping the queen alive with eight hogs still to deploy. Holy. Look at this. He's going to sprinkle these hogs. He doesn't even need them. But he's got... Now the question is time. He's got two headhunters. Dude, Kloss, you're crazy. Sends him into the king. Look at that. It, cl hogs for cleanup. You know? Only Kloss, man. Uses hogs to clean up. I mean, the nice thing is, those cleanup troops can jump walls, so that's nice. You can just jump the walls with this cleanup troops. Boss, you're crazy! What the heck? We have cards again! Alright. Let's see. Hmm. We've got the Builder Huts in the core of the base for stars. Can stars get a defense against six? Count them. Six Super Velks. Whoa. Okay. Super Wall Break his way out on the outside by the Town Hall. Two Bomb Towers are there as well. Hmm. Double Multi-Target Infernos. Oof, look at that core, man. Why did he Wall Break there? Curious. Okay. Charging this queen in with an ice golem and a warden. And there we go. There's the super Valks and Valkyries. He's gonna drop a log launcher. Oh he's gonna he's gonna drop a rage and a warden ability through the core here. They bust through that wall, and the super Valk drops a rage by dying. Oh my goodness. Oh my god, look at all these Oh the rage <laughs> The raged up! Just, they're dying. You can tell when a Super Valk dies. They're just dropping these... <laughs> Holy jays. What is going on? He's still got his king. There's so many rages in the middle. The warden is there. The hound just pops. Sends the king into the defending king. Has five bats to deploy as well. Drops the poison. The queen's trying to clear the core. Headhunter. Ground skelly. His king. Is he going to be able to get through this bomb tower? It does. Opens the wall. Didn't activate the town. What? He didn't activate the town hall. That's crazy. There's the bats up top. Town hall goes down with the king. He's got four free spells. Yo, this is crushed. Wow. Two swags freezes. GG. Super of Valkyries coming in for the triple. Kartik. Wow. 55 seconds. Doctors was on. GG. All they gotta get in their last attack is a one star to win. Basically, I think. Even if Queen Walker's triple. Super Valkyries. You don't see it too often. You see it there. Wow. There was a million rages in the middle of that base. But he broke the base down and tripled. Arctic, nice job. That's the trip. Darkness is on showing their strength here.
Utah 14 is coming in with the 17 sneaky guy. Yo, this Utah, what is your army scroll wheel? Holy jays. He's coming in with one of everything. He's got an E-Dragon. Oh, you guys got a Valkyrie. He's got an Ice. He's got a Golem. He's got... Invis Rage is doing a little bit of a Blizzard action here. Takes out the CC. Pulled the Lava Hound, unfortunately. He locks up on the Lava Hound, which is going to be very painful. He's not taking the Eagle. Oh, he takes the Eagle down. And he pops basically all the pups of the Lava Hound. So, GG. What? Pulls the Tesla farm over at... Three o'clock? Huh? Yo, what? Sends the queen in over at nine. He's got ten more sneaky goblins and an invisibility to help take the town hall down. Rages up the E-Dragon to clear the cannon. And now the air, the air defense is going to be hitting... Holy jeez, the E-Dragon doing work. What? He wall breaks in, taking out that compartment. Super wall break goes over to the Archer Tower. He's got another super wall break to use. He's got, he doesn't have a jump. Oh, the super wall break goes to the middle. What? Holy jeez, he's got the warden ability. No, he already, no, there it is. Never mind. He did have it. Wow, okay. Um, there's a real champion coming in from the top side. Still got 10 sneaky goblins. He's got two invisibility spells. He sends his sneaky goblins into the town hall now. Oh. He hastes them through. Here we go. And he hastes them in. He makes them invisible. Oh, did he make them invisible? And down goes the town hall. What? The Royal Champion is still moving. He's still got two hogs. He drops some balloons on the outside at six. Baby Dragon there as well. RC has her ability. King's ability. RC's ability just went off. Is it enough? He's still got the poison spell. That defending king is annoying. Down goes the air defense. Got a free spell. 18 seconds, though. Oof. 14, 13 is gonna time fail this. Well, no, the king will probably die. Dang it. I don't know why he didn't drop any balloons or hogs over to the right side. Well. He froze and made the last defense visible, so... Way coming in on Stadra. Oh, only dragons. I thought he was gonna come in with like 200 or 300 goblins. <laughs> Literally, he can win with just sending a blimp to the town hall. But all right, well, let's see. He's gonna royal champ with the earthquake onto the town hall. RC ability can take down the builder hut, it means the builder hut has to repair itself. Never mind. It's gone. Town Hall is gone. And there it is. It's locked up, ladies and gentlemen. Darkest moves on. Are going to be victorious. That's it. You can end the raid now and they win. You can just end now. Double seeking air mines there for the balloon. Poisons the headhunters. Baby dragon. Clearing the headhunter. The other headhunter dies. Now Baby Dragon's working on this hound. And there it is. They lock it up. But the builder is repairing the ground expo. Rip. Baby Dragon pops the hound. Drops the dragon to help. That Baby Dragon gets smashed. Alright. Drops some balloons. A dragon's in to the scatter shot with that warden and more balloons. Gets locked down by the Eagle Artillery. We're we gonna see a Warden ability. No, not yet. Drops that Rage. Does he want to protect these loons? Do they travel further into the base? Yes, he does. So they go in. They pull some traps. 
sends the Stone Slammer on the left side. Queen King going on the top. This core, though, could do a massive amount of work to these dragons. Freezes it up. He'll try to keep these dragons moving in. He's got another rage. Two rages, actually. There it is on the top side. Invisibility. Tassel's pop over there. King's got his, his ability to run around. King's eternal tomo, I was about to say. This is crushed, man. He's got an E-Dragon that came out of it. Queen's taking that out. Wait. Doing the only thing he knows. And that's the three-star. He knows the way indeed. Swagging so many spells. Swagging and Viz and two freezes and queen ability. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Way impressive. Impressive stuff right there. GG. That's a trip. All right. And Darkest Muzan are going to be victorious. 14 to 13 here in this war. Wow. Queen Walkers. It's not their day. It was not their day. But GG. This was the... How do I pronounce it? Torno de Fuego uh, show match here. So hopefully you guys did enjoy it. Till next time.